All right, what's going on, everybody? So this was the last boss fight I had to do to get the Bloodborne Platinum Trophy. It is an extremely long process. I wouldn't say getting the Platinum Trophy for this game isn't hard. It's just a very long process. You really, there's a lot you kind of got to do. You kind of, especially with the Chalice Dungeon Trophy at the end, you got to jump through loops. You gotta uh, get some items. You gotta go through like four chalice dungeons to get the right, um, the right uh, materials to create the last chalice dungeon and get to the Thumerian queen right here. I'm assuming the P is silent, but uh, but ultimately, ultimately she's not a hard boss at all. Um, really one of the easier ones. Um, she just you just have to watch out. For you know that trap if you stay around you stay too close to her for too long then you get you know tra trapped in that and then she can take you out in a few hits but uh and then she goes to her next phase where she creates clones of herself and you just got to figure out which one is the right clone which you know isn't isn't hard because once you hit one of them um, they go away but usually I think you can tell especially at the end which one is the real one because they're holding the real one is holding a blood blade at the end so it becomes pretty easy she has some she has some pretty good range attacks uh, that she does in like the second and third stage um, but they're really easy to avoid because they have a really like long startup delay some of them you know um, you could tell when she's gonna do it. She gives a little sign and signal. It's easy to read, so it's not a hard boss at all. I did die a few times, definitely, um, just because I got trapped at bad times. But very easy, um, pretty easy boss. For those of you who, for those of the, for those of people out there who bought Bloodborne and quit, I don't know what to say to you. You know, especially those these YouTubers that claim they're hardcore gamers but couldn't beat this game and it's really not that you know not that difficult after after the third boss i would say it's all downhill from there as far as the difficulty goes you know after the blood starved beast it's it's smooth sailing so if you can just toughen up and make it past that boss you know do a little blood farming and you know, if you're new to this the Soul series, you just have to learn the game a little bit, get used to it. After that, it's just smooth sailing. So, uh, that, you know, anybody who quit on this game, trust me, you know, you're exposed. You're exposed. You are because it's really not that hard. You know, um, Cookie Cookie Monster got the platinum trophy. Hard Eight got the platinum trophy. Um, you know, he, you know, was a little frustrated at the game. Um, in the beginning and people thought people pretty much brushed it off as you know he's casual but he ended up getting the platinum trophy I mean what can you say to that he not only beat the game he went and got the platinum which is definitely not easy because in the chalice dungeons you have to beat you know a whole bunch of bosses um, also so yeah it's I'm not saying like beating Bloodborne and getting the platinum is the ultimate like achievement as far as you know uh, beating some type of you know doing something difficult but I, I think it proves some I think it separates the people who can who can uh, you know handle it and who can and uh, this is my fourth platinum um, on PlayStation 4 because I made a new name uh, different from my PS3 uh, PSN that I had so you know this would be if if I kept the same name this would probably be like my 10th 10th uh, platinum and uh, I actually still don't have the Last of Us Platinum on PlayStation 4, so I'm probably gonna go after that. Probably gonna go after that that one next. But it just feels so good to get the Platinum Trophy. I can tell you, I'm never playing this game again. This game is never entering my console again. Not because I hate the game. You know, it was a, it's a great game. Loved it. But you played so much of it. I got 80 hours in this game. You played so much of it. You love it, but you never want to touch it again. The only way I'm ever coming back to this game is if they have. Uh, some DLC pretty much if they release some DLC then yeah I'll come back and do that other than other than that this game is going in the case never never to see the light of day again 80 hours is where it stops and there's my platinum trophy wait did it come up yet yeah I think it came up there it goes platinum trophy I did it I'm out of here peace